Alright guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and if you are looking for the best screen mirroring tool for your Android phone and iPhone, right, today I have one of the best, I have been using it for a long time right, to mirror my devices to my desktop. Right, so uh, today I will be introducing you this software right here. Right? So this is one of my favorite software to use because one, this thing is super reliable and two, I can uh, mirror multiple devices so I can control multiple of them at the same time. All right. All right. So uh, yeah, so without further ado, let me just show you the software itself. Let's go. All right. So as you guys can see right here, this is the software itself. As you guys see, you can select to mirror iOS devices, your iPhones, Android or DLNA. I think it's um, mirroring protocol for like TV and such. All right, so it's really, really cool. All right? So this software, they advertise for iPhone and Android, but they also, uh, you can also connect at the other features as well. So it's really, really cool. All right. And um, yeah, so for both Android and iOS, all right, you can um, choose it wirelessly or you guys can use it by USB. For me, I would recommend using USB because um, there's more or less latency and much, much better quality over Wi-Fi. Because sometimes Wi-Fi, they might drop its signal strength and charge. Which sometimes you will just lag a bit of charge. Alright, so if you want a very very full anti lag and great great clarity, I would recommend USB. But there's always the wireless version as well, which is really really awesome for a screen mirroring tool. Not much mirroring tool out there also have the wireless version. So when you want to use the wireless version, you probably have to like um, you know uh, use other software. But with this one, they have the wireless and the USB version. Then as for the Android as well. Okay, as you guys can see the Android, uh, you have a uh, USB. You have you can use connect using QR code if the app provided. You can also use Wi-Fi. All right, so you will Wi-Fi if you are connected under the same network. But for iPhone, you just need to um, do the settings of the um, of the or, uh, turn on the screen mirroring the a Apple AirPlay. All right, so um yeah, so it's the both are uh, pretty much similar. Okay, in terms of um, connectivity wise. Alright, and um, yeah, so this software also comes with a lot of other functions. Like you guys can see, you can control with your mouse as well. So you use it to control. Like I say, you can mirror up to like how many devices. So you can put like one software here, two, three. Then you can connect like three of them, three phones simultaneously, three different phones and you can control them simultaneously. So if you're working on like different phones, you can use them to control. So it's very, very effective and very, very efficient. All right, you can turn off the screen on the phone as well. All right, you can take screenshots of it. You can also record screen. So record screen is very, very useful for those people who want to record their gameplay. But if your phone doesn't support, you know, screen recording or you don't want to, you know, utilize your phone um, hardware to record your screen because you want your gameplay to be smooth you can always use the record screen and then you can upload it on youtube or whatever platform you like and as well as you can stream on them like i said earlier on so uh, what you can stream on there is you can there's two options they they very very nicely place two options here very easy to use okay you can either use to conference these software like microsoft teams zoom calls all these okay uh they will have help you uh, integrate into the um those uh, conferencing software or you can use it to live stream to live streaming platforms like youtube twitch you know kick.com all this i right, just key in the url the stream key all right you can choose the stream window and um which what one microphone you can also use your own microphone if you have your own microphone you can use it as well so um yeah more like a you know live streaming and such all right so yeah it's pretty really cool they have all these very comprehensive kind of features for you and also and also they also have this we can um, remap your keyboard you can transfer your files to it as well or you can connect other devices like i say you can connect like multiple mirror to um, software right and uh eh, there you go so once i click multiple devices come out so you can have one android here and one ios here so yeah pretty cool you can just keep adding more and more right just click on it just wait a while and the one just came so you can mirror multiple devices like i say so it's yeah it's very very cool okay and um yeah you also have whiteboard so you can uh, just like you know uh, draw on it and you know show show people and so, so yeah so this thing is really really cool so yeah so right now i'm gonna just uh, demonstrate you to you um uh, quickly how the mirror looks like while, while i mirror my iphone all right so um yeah all right so as you guys can see 
Uh, on the top is the iPhone itself, all right? And uh, yeah, it's mirroring, so you just swipe left, swipe right. You can see that it's a bit of latency, but it still works really well. So this, is, uh, I'm using the wireless version, all right? So you can use the, the wired version as well. But yeah, you can see the quality is still there. It is really, really good. And the latency is very, very sublimal, all right? So it's not very, very much of a hassle, all right? And, and yeah, so as you guys can see, this is a really, really good and reliable software that I always use to, re to mirror my phone, all right? And this is one of my go-to software if I want to mirror my iOS devices or Android. And it's very, very good for productivity as well. Like I say, you can control multiple devices as one. So you don't have to worry about, you know, um, need to reconnect and connect again. You can just add as many as you, your system can handle, okay? And your network can handle. You can have a lot of <laughs> devices mirrored. All right, so um, yeah. All right, so if you guys want a really, really good mirroring software that I recommend will be this iMyPhone Mirror 2. All right, and I will link this software, the first link in the video description down below for you guys to check it out. All right, and uh, just one thing I forget to mention is you can also stream this, all right, either in 1080p, HD, all right, 60 FPS or 2K resolution on your PC, which is really, really cool. So if your network bandwidth us can accept that you can stream in that resolution so it's really amazing all right and there's so many things that you can do on this mirroring software not any other software that can do so much functions a lot of mirroring software i've used throughout the past right, because i'm trying to find the best you know mirroring software to use and most of them they don't have control either one you don't have control or they're just laggy or you know the compression rate is really really bad or they only can mirror one device or you know um you know there is a lot of issues with other mirroring software and you know there's very very limited function and especially this one is the most comprehensive one this one has the most amount of functions and it works really really well out of the box i don't have to do any settings you don't have to do any tweaking some even need to like set the you know the bit rate all this it's really if you don't have you are not in really technical you don't know how to do it right, but with this one just out of the box connect connect just follow some simple steps a few just a few simple steps you can get your phone mirrored and ready to go so yeah this is one of the most and best software that i've used all right that i'm recommending to you guys all right so yeah so once again if you want to check out this software on my phone mirror too do check out the first link in the video description down below try out and highly recommend you guys to get the licensed version because it's very very worth it all right so yeah so that's all for today guys if you find today's video really helpful do give it a thumbs up and if you want more video like this in the future also do let me know in the comment section as well and without further ado this is jforce gaming and i shall see you guys in my next video peace out I don't wanna cry.